This production presents Beckard Environmental's industrial wastewater treatment technology utilizing batch filter press system design. Wastewater generated in the plant flow through collection trenches and receiving pits from where they are pumped to a collection tank called the equalization tank. The equalization tank is equipped with float level sensors that control the transfer pump to the treatment tank. To maintain the equalization tank homogeneous, an air sparge is used. Air generated by the blower, which eliminates dependence on compressed air, maintains the tank agitated and avoids settling out of solids and anaerobic decomposition of the wastewater. Upon the starting of a batch treatment, the equalization transfer pump transfers the wastewater to the treatment tank. On reaching the high level sensor in the treatment tank, the equalization transfer pump automatically stops. The same signal begins the treatment process starting the treatment tank mixer and the recirculation of wastewater in the treatment tank. The recirculation of wastewater in the treatment tank takes water off the bottom and returns it to the top of the tank. In the recirculation circuit, one finds the sludge pump, manual and automated ball valves, and an inline pH electrode. The pH electrode is connected to a pH analyzer, installed in the control panel, that displays the pH of the contents of the treatment tank. The chemical addition phase starts with the addition of coagulant to the treatment tank. Depending on the nature of the wastewater, the coagulant can be added by pH or volume. After the coagulant addition is complete, the alkali pump is activated, which is deactivated once the proper pH has been reached, determined by the pH electrode and the analyzer's program set point. The addition of these chemicals permits the breaking of emulsions and coagulation of colloids, which appears as small particles separating from the wastewater. At this point, the recirculation stops, as well as the mixer in the treatment tank. The flocculant is then added by volume, after which the mixer turns on for a short time to mix the contents of the tank. The flocculant enlarges the coagulated wastewater for ease of settling and the ability to dewater the sludge in the filter press later. The system then begins the settling phase, where the flock, now called sludge, settles to the bottom of the treatment tank. Once the settling phase is complete, the system transfers the clarified water to the filter press. This stage ends once the water reaches the mid-float level sensor. This activates the phase of sludge transfer to the filter press, starting with the activating of three-way valves that allow the pump to draw sludge off the bottom of the tank and transfer it to the filter press. With this phase, the dewatering of the sludge begins. In the dewatering phase, the sludge pump works through several increments of pressure of sludge transfer to the filter press. This is controlled through monitoring the sludge pump with a stroke monitoring device and transducer controlled by the PLC. The sludge in the treatment tank contains 95 to 99 percent water and on being pumped to the filter press, the solids are retained in the chambers of the filter plates while the filtered water is discharged through the corner discharge ports and collects in an inspection tank. From this inspection, or filtrate tank, the water is transferred to a treated water holding tank that is equipped with air diffusers like the equalization tank. From this tank, the water can be reused in the plant or discharge. Once the dewatering stage is complete, the operator discharges the filter cakes from the filter press. The cakes contain the contaminants of the wastewater in solid form, up to 55% solids content.
The Pickard PLC automated batch filter press requires minimal operator intervention, which consists of replenishing chemical tanks, emptying the filter press, general housekeeping and inspection of water quality. The design of the control panel permits the automated treatment of a batch. Displays on the panel show the various stages as they occur and the PLC permits the stopping of the process at any time for adjustment or other needs and the restarting of the process from the point it was detained through the remaining stages. The Pickard batch filter press system permits the removal of many contaminants such as heavy metals, suspended solids, settleable solids, fats, oils and greases, BOD5. We have used our Beckert batch filter press systems to effectively treat wastewater generated in diverse industries such as corrugated box manufacturing, adhesives manufacturing, plating and metal finishing industries, paints and pigment manufacturing, flexographic packaging industries, and many others. Consult with our engineers for your particular needs.